Hi, welcome to another buzzing walkabout here on Buzzing Pattaya. And uh, tonight I'm down Soy 8 uh, on the hope that if you watch the video I did recently of Soy 7, that Soy 8 may be a little bit better than what Soy 7 was. I'm not really holding that much hope. And uh, I apologize for both the Soy 7 video and probably for this video, because I doubt very much there'll be anything here that uh, will be of any interest. And I know I'm saying that at the beginning of the video and you're quite right to just say, well then to hell with it to switch off. But anyway, I like to be honest, you know my channel, you know the way I am, I don't hide anything. So uh, I don't know what's down Soy 8 right now. I really haven't been down here for a long time, but I'm willing to go down, have a look and see. And uh, like I did, uh, sorry, like I said in the Soy 7 video, you know, if you did used to come down Soy 8, you know, please drop a comment below where was your go-to place in Soy 8? Where was a good place you could recommend to go back in the day? And uh, let's see if there's any signs of life that those places that you do name drop may come back from the dead and uh, rise from the ashes. Who knows? All right, well, let's uh, spin the camera around and let's have a walk down and see what is going on down in Soy 8 behind me. All right, let's go. Okay, so let's have a, a wander down and uh, I'm not sure if you did see the, the Soy 7 video, that was hilarious. I'd only got like 50 yards up the Soy and this woman had a right go at me saying, don't you take video, don't take video. And I'm like, I haven't, you know, what, what's your problem? But anyway, hopefully that won't happen tonight. And uh, if it does happen tonight, then I seriously am going to have to rethink whether or not I should charge damages to my health for making these videos for you guys because <laughs> uh, it really was one of those uh, unexpected outbursts. Now the problem I've got, as you can see now already, I mean, honestly lads, th this is Soy 8. This is not a make-believe uh, screen setup or anything like that. This genuinely is Soy 8. And I mean, well, what, on the, what in the world am I gonna talk to you about? I mean, look at it, it's just, the only thing you can see is the car headlights in the distance. And that's about the most exciting part of the soy so far. So I really do apologize about this, but unfortunately my hands are tied. I mean, there really is nothing going on. It's just, and, and even these couple of bars that have got a few lights on, I mean, why? Why are you, why are you even bothering? I mean, there's just nobody here. It really is just, well, it's just soul destroying. It really is. And you know, there's a lot of talk about the future of Soy 8 as well as Soy 7. And they're saying, oh, you know, they're going to change these into uh, hotels and restaurants, etc., etc. Oh, there's a little bit of life up there that you can see up the top there. And uh, there seems to be something going on. Not quite sure. A few girls out the front there. I mean, bless them, fair play. Uh, but yeah, there's a lot of talk about changing Soy 8 into a hotel stroke restaurant area and when you look at this video and when you see what's going on right now to be honest with you it does make perfect sense because as you're seeing there is just nothing diddly squat going on there really is nothing so where or how will this soy return i mean i don't think it will what do you think guys you know what do you feel about soy eight i mean it just doesn't look like anything's happening. Easterly Plaza, you know, all these places that back in the day used to be very, very busy, as you can see, it just, it's just, I feel like I'm walking through a movie set and that they haven't actually said, and action, and everyone's just still in the makeup artist rooms and stuff and they're not yet come out. But uh, unfortunately, as you can see in here, I mean, you know, there's one customer over there and I'm not gonna get him on camera, but there's one customer over there in this bar, I mean, and here, I mean, look at these beer bars. Now I believe, and correct me if I got this wrong, there was a guy called Adam who owned one of the bars. Was it Poppy Bar? I'm not 100% sure, but I think it was Poppy Bar. Oh, look, see, look, here we go. There are, there's some pussy down here. There we go. Hello. Ah, all right. So, yeah, going back to it, was it, was it the, or was it the cherry bar? I think it might be the cherry bar or the poppy bar was Adam. I'm not sure. If, if you know who I'm talking about, please 
confirm it for me. Was it, was it the Cherry Bar or was it the Poppin' Bar? Adam used to run trips over to go and watch Patea United play football. And uh, they were always a great crack, really good fun. I don't know if any of you have been to see Patea play. At, uh, they're more of a glorified Sunday league team, but nevertheless, they, they worked hard. Now this here, rolling live. I mean, you know, to see it like this is just heartbreaking. It really is it's just incredible. There's nothing whatsoever happening here, nothing. Subway's closed. So many of these places are closed. For sale, for sale. You know, there's two or three units for sale here. So, yeah. Well, if nothing else, I've at least done what you asked me to do. Uh, quite a few of you were asking me about Soy 7 and Soy 8. So uh, we've got this out of the way now. At least I can tick those boxes to say, yep, I've done these for you. And, uh, and that's it. Now, one place that is open, and uh, I'm just going to keep the camera this way because there's customers in there. I don't want to speak, uh, get them on camera. Hello, hello. Hello, hello. All right, now the sailor bar. Um, let me get a better angle for you because uh, there's customers in there. I don't really want to get them on camera. So let's go for that one. There you go. Now the sailor bar, that really was an absolutely brilliant place to go. Amazing cocktails, fantastic product. You see the prices here, all beers and cocktails, 55 baht. I mean, seriously, 55 baht. That's just incredible. And it really was a very, very popular bar back in the day. And the good news is, is it's at least open now. So, you know, they're trying their best. They're keeping the business open, which is good. So fair play to them. All right, so we're nearly down now towards Beach Road. And uh, there's just a couple more little bars here. Not a lot going on. And uh, I think uh, they've seen me with the camera, so they're gonna take cover. Let's just let this uh, food van come past. Come on, let's go. There's not a lot happening. Come on, let's go. No, I don't want any strawberries, thank you. There you go, look, the strawberry van. If you want your strawberries, your fresh strawberries, look at those. Wow, hello. All right, they love the strawberries here, love them. Reminds me of when I was back home in Wimbledon, you used to go to the tennis. Oh, strawberries, they were such a fortune. They used to charge crazy money for a punny of strawberries. And all the Ruperts that used to go and watch it were stupid enough to pay it. In unbelievable. But uh, hey ho, that is, that's what it is. All right, so we're coming down towards the end now. It sounds like there's a live band going on, which is nice. On the corner, or not on the corner bar, but this bar here on the corner. And uh, so that's good. At least uh, someone's making an effort. Let's see what's going on in there, shall we? Tiger bar, is that what place you used to hang out in? Not so much now, unfortunately. All right, so let's spin around. And so they got a live band over there. See over in the corner, the live band. All right, fair play to them. Well, there's a fair few people in there. There's a lot of girls, quite a few, well, not quite a few, but there's a fair few customers. So uh, not too bad. And across the road there, sadly, the coconut bar is still empty. There's not much going on there, but uh, Hey-ho, all right, that's it. So let's have a, oh, this is, uh, that's Corando's. That's Corando's uh, pizza place. Remember, I spoke to Rocky the other day and uh, that's his pizza place. And I have to say, I had one of his pizzas the other day when I did his photo shoot and uh, it was awesome. Really, really nice. Very, very good quality. All right, so let's head down. We'll head down towards uh, Soy 7. And then uh, oh, some more live music over there. That's good to see. There we go. Look at him. All right. You know, if ever you want a tip on how not to get accosted by women, just carry a dummy phone in your in your hand because they really don't like it. And this lady here hasn't seen me. Oh, she has. Yep. Yeah. yeah, they really don't like it, and they just turn their back and leave you alone. So there you go. If if you don't want to be accosted, go and buy a plastic phone and just walk around with it and they hide. Uh, all right, so let's see what the rates are. So here we go. Uh, today's rates, 42.22, that's on the slide. Aussie dollar, ruble, yeah. I don't know how that compares to uh, your rates, but uh, yeah, not fantastic. 
All right, so let's head back. Let's keep the camera away. There's customers in there. I don't want to get them on the film. All right. And that's it. We're back to the beginning now. Soy 7. And I'm not going up Soy 7 in case that woman shouts at me again. She had the right arm. All right, so let me just go over to where my motorbike is and uh, let's uh, wrap it up. Incidentally, do you remember the other day? In fact, actually, let's have a quick nip down there. Let's just wander down very quickly. Do you remember the other day I showed you here on Beach Road that they'd done these new illuminations? Well, I said I would come down one evening. So uh, as Soy 8 was a complete disaster, and there was zero activity, and uh, I would say zero, the sailor bar, excuse me, the sailor bar. Um, but apart from that, there was no lights or anything. Let's go and look at this quickly, and then we'll head back. And uh, I have to give them their due, credit where credit's due. They are doing their best to try and make it a bit more attractive. And uh, as you can see here, look, you know, very nice. So it looks good, looks very nice. And uh, I'll just show you these uh, illuminations. You can see them down there. And then we'll head back. Across the road there, there's Witherspoons. I'm gonna go in there soon and uh, have a look in there. I've not been in there myself, but we'll go down and uh, maybe I'll do a coffee. I'll tell you what I'll do. I'll do the, um, the uh, your questions answer. We'll do that from there. We'll do that. So, uh, okay, as you can see up ahead there, I'm gonna finish off up here as well. So no, no point walking back. So uh, let's walk down. I think there's some people in there doing their photos. They love their photos, don't they? Unbelievable. Thai women, they're either sleeping or they're taking pictures. That's the name of the game. So let's go and see. Hopefully she won't shout at me. Put her on camera. Okay, so as you can see, we'll let them take their pictures. But as you can see, they look very, really, really pretty. Really pretty. And, uh, you know, to be fair, they have done a good job. And uh, unfortunately, some of the other illuminations up here are not uh, switched on. All right, guys, so let's wrap this up then. Uh, where should we? Well, let's wrap it up with them behind me. One second. Okay guys, so that's it for me today here on Buzzing Walkabout, on Buzzing Pattaya. Uh, as I say, I'm really sorry that Soy 8 was as flat as a pancake. There's not much I can do about it, unfortunately, but at least you've seen firsthand what's going on, or rather what isn't going on, and at least you now know how Soy 8 is looking right now, uh, right here in Pattaya. So uh, there you go, guys. All right, so that's it for me. Please remember to hit the subscribe button and also the bell icon if you'd like to be notified when I bring out a new video, please check out our members area. There's more and more businesses joining now that are gonna offer you discounts for when you come in and show your digital ID card, which is great news. And uh, if you haven't already, please join our Telegram group. We've got over 2,000 people in the group. It's going from strength to strength. Lots of things happening in there. So please, guys, join that. All right, guys, that's it for me today. Thank you so much for watching, and uh, I look forward to seeing you in the next video very soon. Okay, wherever you are in the world, please, Stay safe.